Welcome to another edition of WD-168. You know what the news is. You hear the news. You see the news. You live the news. We're here to maybe spray it a little bit and get some of the rust off and see what's going on in your life, in the church life, and all around us. We start off today's news by remembering an incident that took place just a couple days ago and has shook up the entire world. Not just the sports world, but of course I'm talking about the passing of basketball legend Kobe Bryant, along with his daughter and seven others in a tragic, tragic helicopter accident this past Sunday. Kobe is said to say, Everything negative, pressure, challenges, is an all an opportunity for me to rise. And certainly he did rise to the occasion, as is evident by the outpouring of love and affection. Along with the millions throughout the world, the Armenian Church expresses its condolences to the Bryant family, to the many families that were affected by this, and to one of our own, Ara Zobayan, the pilot of the helicopter. And let's take an opportunity to remember all of the families in our prayers, but also remember the opportunities that are given to us by people throughout the world who become inspirations and remind us to live the day for its, for its blessings and the day for the day. The coronavirus, you've heard about it. You're hearing about it. It's coming from someplace in China and they tell you about it. Watch how people are traveling. Contagion, remember that? Don't touch anything, don't talk to anybody, don't breathe. Take a moment to put it all in perspective. We're living in a big world. There are all kinds of challenges every day. Be careful, be cautious, but don't panic. Loneliness is on the rise. Can you believe in this world with so many people, loneliness is on the rise and younger workers and social media users feel it most. This is a new study that just came out a week ago. And we bring it up because so many times in church life, we always remember about the mystical qualities of the church, forgetting that one of the most important part of church is fellowship, is the opportunity to come together, to see people, and to create a larger family. Remember, the first battle against loneliness is your local church. The St. Vartan Oakland Church said goodbye to their pastor who returned to Armenia in a beautiful celebration and an outpouring of love. Community members, youth came together to say thank you to Father Hovel Ohanian, who served diligently as the pastor of the St. Vartan Church for the past 10 years. We offer our prayers to the community and we wish all the best to Father Ohanian as he continues his ministry to the Armenian Church in Armenia. Our primate returns from Egypt and Italy as reported to you in, if you haven't seen it, check out AC202, we talked about it. Etchmiadzin is under renovation and our primate is visiting all of the different dioceses throughout the world to get people to understand that Etchmiadzin is our center and it needs our love and our support. Make sure you do check it out. And on that same line, I want to invite you to some of the important things that are coming up. Namely, mark it on your calendar. March 14, we're having Reclaim 2020. And this year's theme is Etchmiadzin. Reclaim Etchmiadzin. Mark it on your calendar and we'll have some more information coming up shortly. Also mark on your calendar next month, February 26th, Women's Prayer Day. We'll be talking about the vestments. And with that, we wrap up WD 168 for this week. We look forward to being with you again next week. Until then, reminding you that, you know, if you, things are rusty, take a moment, spray it, and you'll see clearly. God bless you. <laughs>